welcome to another episode of What Travis Says. My name is Travis and today we're continuing my Doctor Who rewatch. Today we'll be talking about Season 9, Episode 2 of Doctor Who titled The Witch's Familiar. The Doctor is trapped, surrounded by a Dalek city, no Sonic, no TARDIS, and no one to come help. And in line with the number of main doctors, I will give you 13 interesting facts about this episode. Missy references Elton John's The Bitch Is Back by telling a Dalek those exact words, making this one of the very rare instances of a minor expletive in the series. The last expletive was spoken by Rose Tyler over 10 years prior. The doctor says that he left Gallifrey because he was bored. Previously, the second doctor said the same thing in the adventure The War Games. Clara hides inside of a Dalek shell, which is very reminiscent of when Ian, one of the doctor's very first companions, hid inside of a Dalek shell in the first Dalek adventure. In Missy's story sequence, the fourth Doctor and the first Doctor are both seen as Missy tries to remember which incarnation had the adventure in her story. In Resurrection of the Daleks, while in his fifth incarnation, the Doctor had also pointed a gun at Davros and threatened his life. This is not the first time that the Doctor and the Master have teamed up against a common enemy. Previous fragile alliances have happened in The Claws of Axis, The Five Doctors, and The End of Time. Davros tells the Doctor that he's very privileged to be using the only other chair on the planet Skaro. This is a reference to the classic adventure The Daleks, where Barbara says that on the Daleks' homeworld, there is no furniture. The scenes on Scaro were filmed on the slopes of, fittingly, an active volcano. Both River Song and now Missy are shown to carry handcuffs with them at all times. Dying Davros telling the Doctor that he wants to look at him with his own eyes is reminiscent of a certain Darth Vader scene in Star Wars, who is also hooked up to mechanical life-sustaining apparatuses. This episode is not the first time that a Dalek is shown to have a concept of mercy. In The Big Bang, a Dalek says that its records show that River Song will show mercy because she is a companion of the Doctor and is subsequently proved very wrong. This episode was not the first licensed Doctor Who narrative to feature a Dalek using Time Lord regeneration energy. In the 1987 book, The Doctor Who Fun Book, there exists a comic strip titled Regeneration of a Dalek. In Asylum of the Daleks, the Doctor jokingly taunts a Dalek by saying, Who's your daddy? But after the events of this episode, it seems that there is a logistical claim to be made that the Doctor is the Dalek Daddy. Or at least the Dalek Granddaddy. Stick around for tomorrow's video where we talk about the next episode, Under the Lake. But that's it for this episode of my Doctor Who Rewatch. As always, my name is Travis. Thank you for listening to what I have to say, and you will see me tomorrow. Thank <laughs> you.